With the help of the Canadian Centre for DNA Barcoding, or CCDB, the International Barcode of Life Project is creating a barcode reference database of short standardized gene regions. Their goal is the identification and discovery of 5 million specimens from more than 500,000 species over the next five years. Here's the CCDB's protocol for preparing a 96-well plate for cycle sequencing reaction. In the lab, cycle sequencing analysis is performed to obtain the nucleotide sequence of the barcode region. Cycle sequencing requires highly accurate and precise volume measurements and pure DNA samples. This pre-made sequence plate contains primer, reagents, and big dye terminator for the sequencing reaction. Prior to cycle sequencing, the PCR products are diluted threefold with water using the Liquidator 96. Clean tips are used to add two microliters of diluted PCR product to two pre-made sequencing plates, each containing a different primer. Note how the Liquidator 96 head is lifted slightly, such that blowout can be done directly above the liquid surface. The tips are then touched off and the handle slowly released. Following centrifugation, the plate is placed into the PCR machine for amplification, completing the cycle sequencing PCR setup. This high-success plate processes 90 samples and goes straight into the sequencing reaction, 